I take this one and I, uh, no, it's not. Oh, yeah, I drag it over right here. I drag it over so I've saved it. See that? Where do you, how, that I don't know how to do. You drag it over where? Yeah, yeah. Okay, let me show you. <laughs> Go away. Go away. All right, here's the image that I found that I like, okay? Yes. So here's my cursor. Okay. Yes. Yes. Click and hold. Click and hold and drag it to your desktop. To the desktop. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now you won't be able to see this. Can you see my settings? Yes. You can? Yes. 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 All right. So now I click right here on this uh, little cross. It says add image okay wait wait add image add image no i'm in background. the zoom settings under backgrounds oh okay background and filters and okay. you just see this none right here you don't yes see it. yes yes yeah, i have a bunch of them so i click and i say add image see that see what i'm doing no that i don't see because there's something oh 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 wait 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 add image I see it. I'm, I'm uh, I don't it. see it now. I don't see add image yet. Blur, blur. blur. Hey, okay, little... I I see add image. Yes, yes. Once you see, I you don't see it there, but once you click and hold. Right, it, right, right. I see. All right. right. So I clicking... understand. Yes. Okay, I'm clicking on add image. Yes. And then I make sure I'm in my desktop. If I'm not, then I use this to go to where I want to go. Mm-hmm. But right now I'm in my desktop, and in fact, right now if I made this icons, you could see that I have this picture that I just saved. Yes, right? yes, yes. Okay, yes. so I say open. Down here at the bottom I say open, mm -hmm. and it brings it down here. It adds it, mm -hmm. and it makes it my new background. See how my background has changed? Yes, I see flowers now. That's all. So yes. I brought, I have a bunch of them that I brought in that I like, and I change different ones from time to time. I see. Very nice. Thank you. Yeah. Here's, I try it. Yes. I have all kinds of things depending on my mood. Beautiful. Ah, I see. Then I, then once you have it there, all you have to do is click it. Yeah. Right. And when you have more than one, you can go around and you can try different ones and see what you mm -hmm. like that. I To me, I have to have the right one or I can't concentrate. So where's my one that I was using that I wanted? You were using some beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's here, it's here somewhere. There it is. This is the one everybody likes. Everybody likes this one. I don't know. Yeah. Why it's so special, but everybody loves it. So thank you. That's nice. Okay. Uh, Valentina, do you have any questions? I have a lot of questions, but go ahead. Even, uh, say one of them anyway. Even right now, when I open Google and find images and click on it, I have nothing on my desk. Well, you got to move it over like Marif showed you. You yeah. drag it over to your desktop. Let, let's explain. No, that. I don't see it. All right, hold on. Image. Hold on, Valentina. We'll explain it, okay? Here, here. Let me, let me do that over again. So you put it in the top. You put flowers or something, whatever you're looking for. You see that? Can you see my screen where <laughs> yes, I'm yes. going, Google? Okay. Yes. So you see how I typed in what I'm looking for, right? Yes. Okay. But but on my screen, I don't see this. Well, look okay. at her screen maybe, until you learn maybe. it. Uh-huh. Okay. Yes, I didn't write it because... Okay. All right. So then, uh -huh. you, so then you go down the page and you say, which one of these do I like? See how I'm doing? Going down and looking at all of them. See that? Yes, I see, but a little bit different uh, 
screen. Oh. Someone's no. waiting in the waiting room, Marsha. Oh, okay. Let me get there. Oh, oh I guess I, I can admit Lana her. I did it. I admitted her already. Okay. Hi, Svetlana. Is that sorry? Is that, that sorry? Svetlana, my friend. Let's see who it is. Hi, hello. I saw all your uh, pieces on YouTube about Jewish... I learned yesterday, and to, uh, thank you so much about course for today. Um, okay, I want to hear about what you said now. After that, I have questions. Thank you. Okay. So, Lana, why don't you share your video so we can talk with you easily? You know how to do that? Yeah, she's a, she uh, runs things at the center, so she's pretty. I know, good. but we don't see her video, so. Well, Mary, how to do that? Can I ask a question, Mary? Yeah. I I got the picture. I got it. Uh, I dragged it to where it. And now, how do I get it to the bus, uh, to the desktop? Okay, there's two ways. First, let's say I like this picture. Can you everybody see? I'm moving my cursor over a picture. See that? But, yeah. Yeah. Okay. First off, I click on it and it will come up like this. And now either I can press down with my cursor and grab the image. See what I've, can you see how I've grabbed the yeah, image? Yeah, I already dragged it, but it's not on the desktop. It's somewhere. All right. The second way you can do it, I don't, I, I'd have to see your screen to see what's happening, but the second yeah. way you can do it, I wish this thing would stop. All right, is to, um, let's see, uh, Marcia, what is it on PC? Okay, I right click and make a copy of it. Right, okay, okay, <laughs> right. You don't have to make a copy, but right click, and it will open this, and it, and you can do down, down. Um, sorry. Um, save image to the desktop. See that? Save image to the desktop. Can you see my command? See where I'm over, Vera? Yeah, no, because I didn't get back to Zoom yet. Wait. No, not in Zoom. This is in no, your no. browser. This is in Oh, Google. I see. Yeah, now I got it all messed up. So, uh... see? see? All right, let's go over this. I picked out this image. See where? Tell me yes if you see what I'm doing because no, I don't yes, see I what you think I, no, I don't because I minimal minimalized it too much. I, so I, I just, I'm I recording it. It's on the recording. To, wait, wait, wait. Right. I to, now I don't. I have to. All right, but, all right, Vera. Vera, hold on. Can you see my web web page with all the images I, on? I do. I do. Yes. All right. I, can, can you see my cursor over this yeah, yes, yes. lovely flower picture? So yes. what I'm doing, I'm right on yours. You would right click and hold down okay. over that picture, and then it says right here, "Save image to the desktop." Uh, okay, good. That's one way All to right, do. Try doing that. Find a picture you like. And do save image to the desktop. I have to go back back to Google again. Wait. Right. <laughs> I have to minimize you again. Uh, exit full screen side by side. No, no, no. Uh, it's so difficult. Yeah, you're on a tiny little little screen. I think right. You're not. I on am. A, yeah. I am. No, I am on. Yeah. You're not on a computer, right? I am. I am. Wait, I'm oh. on the full, full screen now. I already got out of this picture. Wait. Oh, God. I'm going to go I back to I think if you look at the video, you might catch on. I need you to show Svetlana K something because she does a lot of presentations. Okay. And I want you to show her how to do um, a recording when she's showing her uh uh, share screen to make sure that the sound comes on for her audience. Make you know. You oh know. yeah, okay. Oh, okay. could you just show her yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. This was my question. 
Uh, Marsha, you know about my question. I want to know uh, yeah. how you do recording for. I your... want you to see because that Lana, uh, uh, Marie was going to show you. Okay. She's going to share the screen and show you. Uh, she's either from uh, YouTube or whatever it is you want to make sure that your audience will hear the sound and, you, and what you need to do. Here's what you need. Uh, Valentina, when you, or Svetlana, when you, when you do share screen, this big white box come up, comes up. Do you see that? A big white box? She knows that. Yeah, she, she Okay. Knows well, I, the, the, I'm, down at the bottom, you have to tell her yeah, what Yeah, right have. down, right down here at the bottom. I know, I know about this. I don't know say, if you want to do a uh, recording. For, for, yeah, yeah. For, for example, for this program, I, I do program in, I, if but, I want to record my program, what I can... The main thing is, that Lana, you just need to click on share sound. Do not click on optimize. Marie discovered that the optimize for video clip is, is, a, is well, not it good. Causes, okay. It causes problems. Yeah, so, so just you, make sure you, to, clear, to click on share... Click on share sound, and then you could uh, do everything else. That's the main yes. thing. You want the optimize for video clip, you want to be blank. You don't want to have that checked, but the share sound, you have to have I checked. I do, I do, I know this. Okay, okay. Okay, so we'll ask another question about what you're doing. You're making a recording. Recording. For yeah, you program. We do now program. And I want to record this program. What do I need to do? You just press the recording and save it I, to I your don't... computer. Do not oh, save oh, it to the cloud. Wait, save it to wait. your computer. Marsha, Marsha, I don't think she can record. If, but if she, not... she can do it because I know Svetlana. I know what she's doing. But not this meeting. Because I'm not mean? telling her to do it. For, she's not asking you for this meeting. Oh, oh, she's okay, asking okay. for her oh, meeting. Oh, oh, okay, okay. And what she is going to do is record her meetings, but she's got to save it to the computer, not to the cloud, because when she saves it to the computer, she can edit it, and then she can put it on YouTube, or she could just save it on her computer and... And I'll tell you another way to send big files. I just discovered it also. Okay, that I just want to make sure I throw that. I know Svetlana is very active and she is doing a lot of uh, work. So there's something important that she needs to know. Okay. So I'm glad I just threw that out. If you have any other questions, Svetlana, just let us know. Any other questions? I have two questions. First question, recording program. Second question, you, for example, open your YouTube channel. Uh, do you have uh, about this in YouTube information? Because I saw your, uh, Marsha, many your program on YouTube, very good program. And I want to know about how you did YouTube channel? I, I have a, um, a movie editing uh, movie. A couple of movie editing programs you can get can get. And uh, that's what I'm using to edit the program. And then after I edit it, sometimes I don't have to edit, but a lot of times there are things you have to cut out. So you edit it first in a movie making program. And then uh, when it's ready, you go onto YouTube and you uh, press the button that says to paste it in there. I think Marie does it too. Yeah, I can. Do you want to know how to put things on YouTube, Valentine? Yeah. Uh, Svetlana? Yes. Yeah, okay, I can show you. Uh. So I go, I go to YouTube, I have a link already, and this is my, you have to, you have to become a member, you have to join YouTube, that's the first step, do you know how to do that? 
No, I don't know. All right, so you how, go to, how, I, how I can do this? You go to YouTube, uh, and actually it's not going to show me because I'm already a member. There'll be something that says that if you say join, join YouTube channel. Here, you have to go here. Uh, I haven't done this in so long because I'm a member already. Yeah. Oh, this it tells you right there, YouTube memberships. Where? Here. Okay, I see and, YouTube channel membership. Maybe I can. Okay, so you have to become a member. Uh, in order to use YouTube, you you uh, as a if you're not a member, you can see things, but you can't upload, you can't uh, you know edit, you can't uh, you have to that you have to join YouTube. That's the first step. Okay. All right. So once you've joined YouTube, you'll see. Whoops, where is I? Here. This is my site on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And it won't, if you went here, you wouldn't see this. You would, all you would see would be probably like this. You would see some of my videos that I've shared. But you won't see these two blue, see these customized channel and manage videos? Mm -hmm. That's only there because I'm a member. Okay? Okay. So you have to join first, then you'll see this. So once you've joined... And I know that I'm on because, see, I see my little profile picture up here. See mm -hmm. that? Mm -hmm. So I know that it's on. I'm Occasionally I get uh, kicked out of YouTube and I have to put my password in again. But right now, because I, I can see my image here and I can see my little image here, I know I'm in my, my account. Okay? So then you click on, on Manage Videos. Okay. And right here, these are all the videos that I've uploaded, which nobody else can see because they're private. But right here, there's this button, Create. Okay. You see that, the Create? Yes. Okay. All right, you click on that, and right there, Upload Videos. And then you can either drag something in, a video that you want to put, you can drag it in there, or you can use this, and you can go find it on your desktop or wherever, you know. Mm -hmm. This allows you right here. You can go anywhere on your computer from here up, up at the top. I got to ask a question. Yeah. My question is: uh, Have you ever uh, done a live uh, presentation on YouTube? I've done it with uh, Facebook, but I'd like to do it with uh, YouTube. Well, we, we could figure it out together. I yeah, never... somehow it asks me too many questions when yeah, I'm... Doing... Let's make sure that Svetlana has her, all her... Is that all you needed, Svetlana, about how to uh, bring uh, uh, videos up into YouTube? Have we answered your question? Uh, this, uh, thank you so much. I understand what you say. Now, My, when, uh, this is very, very interesting. I, I must to see a movie about this, too. Yeah. But, but I have so, questions. For example, our program. Or oh, I do program. I have now um, many interesting uh, people from uh, art uh, section. They okay. uh, want their program um, recording to YouTube. For example, if I now do program. You now do program. Yeah. Uh, what you uh, can do that this program will be recorded. I'm so sorry about um, at metabolite rate, Mari. Yes, at metabolite rate. Uh, maybe uh, not, 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 not no. very well. Not very uh, well. Okay. Okay. Yeah, maybe could translate. <laughs> I do, but not for a, not for a, a discussion <laughs> like this. Not well enough. Okay. Uh, uh, my question: If we do program in this time, and I want to record this program, yes. And after that, what you did now send to the YouTube channel. But at first, I must record this program. 
Yeah. There is this option in Zoom if I won't record. I know I see symbol record. Record uh, symbol in the where is the mute start video participant chat share record. Is yeah. This this option. Yeah, yes. that's the right place. Yes. This right place. You have to be uh, a host of the program or someone has given, yes, have to course. given you permission to record, but that's all. I think you just hit the record and you know what? I don't know. Have you? Have yeah, there, she, uh, she, she's a host, a co-host or a host. But I mean, oh, are so there I other, tell her one more thing. Marcia, once you hit record, are there other questions it asks you after that? I've only done it once. so I The other that. question is, where do you want it to go when you're finished? That question is, I'm telling you, please do not use the, uh, the cloud. cloud. Use the, the uh, yes. computer. Save it, to, you'll be save able it to, to your own computer. Yes. And one it's other good. thing is you're going to come up against is if, if anybody is using copyright music, they're going to say it's copyrighted. They may give you a little problem. Uh, most I of was, actually, I was okay. going to explain that also, Svetlana. Yes, right here here's what it looks like when you once you start uploading it comes up with this thing that asks you a bunch of questions okay and one of them is important thing is it, it you must say is this video for kids or not always mm -hmm. say no it's not for kids because mm -hmm. if it's for kids they have a whole bunch of different restrictions on it and things that it, it, it's a mess just i mean i i suppose people who upload things for kids find this useful but it's a pain from for yeah just ordinary so always say no it's not made for kids and then at the very end oh here it will say visibility right here is where you can change the visibility from public private unlisted either do unlisted or private if you do public then youtube comes in and checks all kinds of things is this is this uh um copyrighted and all that stuff mm -hmm. so if i go back here to all my ones that i've done see i do all of them unlisted and even when there's a copyright claim they don't bug me they don't bug you when it's public either. I mean, most, but they maybe only if you're set to make money from it. Maybe then. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. I don't, these are just things I uploaded for myself. So I make them all either private or unlisted. And even if there's a copyright claim, nothing happens. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, most. Of See that, Svetlana? Okay. Are you following okay. what we're saying? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So then, when it's private or unlisted. You have to, nobody can find it by searching YouTube. Nobody can stumble on it. You have to give people the link to it for yeah. them to be able to see it. But the other way, if it's public, you don't have to worry. Everybody could see right. it. Right. If it's public, then anybody who goes to your channel can see it. But, you know, then you have to, maybe might have to worry. I know I uploaded a whole movie that I like. Um, so whole movie private. I understand this. Well, hold on. Let me show you this. Um, it's a wonderful movie that I highly recommend. Um, called Rouge Besse. Where did I put it? Marie yeah. sent me the. the and and, and, and one and one time I uploaded, uh, you know, Cirque du Soleil, and you know it said it came on with all this. It sent me a big message about how this is, you know. Uh, you can't share this and blah, blah, blah. But, and I thought, oh my God, they've taken it off. I'm not going to have it there anymore. And I came here and it was still, still right there. I can watch it. Yeah. Whenever I, which is all I put it up for. I put, been putting things up here that I, I want to, uh, you know, be able to remember how to get to. And Some, there's something else. I put I a whole movie and they, I can still watch it. No problem. So, Marie, there's something else of importance about Yeah, this. yeah. Uh, with the with the uh, YouTube, 
uh, some people join YouTube. They pay a certain amount every month so that they don't get any ads. They don't get any interference. I haven't done that yet. I've been with YouTube yeah, for about 20 a, years. It's and about I ten. Paid for it, but it might be an idea if you don't want the it's ads. It's about it's about ten dollars a month. I heard ten dollars a month. That's mm. not that's a reasonable. If you do it a lot, like well. Like it, like it, for ASEA, for example, people who who run programs where they show a lot of YouTubes and they don't want to be bothered with getting past the ad, it'd be worth the money. But for me, it's not worth it, so yeah. I don't I don't bother. Okay, Svetlana, did we answer your? Do we uh, explain well enough? Can we? Do you do you have other questions about doing that? Thank you so much and um, Marsha, for example, I want to be uh, subscribed to your channel. I saw you, Marsha, and I do like, but what I, where I need to uh, be if I want to be, to be one of your um, participant i want you channel. to be when when you want to be i have the the webinar you could come on do programs and uh, i'll be so happy if you would if, you know bring your talented people and uh and we'll we'll put on some programs no i, I, saw, you. I, I saw you being i saw your song and i saw your any another program with with Mar Marie, this was a wonderful program, we, uh, Jewish. Uh, I learned about your YouTube because I not have time in that time to be with, yeah. uh, with you. Can you come on Tuesday morning? We, ha we go to Houston, Texas, and then in the afternoon we go to California. The two wonderful Yiddish programs. So if you will, uh, I'll send you the, the links and maybe you'll come. They there's some wonderful technology technologians there. So, uh, <laughs> we le all learn from each other. Where I can subscribe to your channel? What I need to do? For she example, wants to. Uh, I'll Marcia, send you the link. Marcia, sh share your screen and bring up your YouTube channel and show her where to subscribe. Uh, I'll email. It's easier for me just to email her the information. I I'm in contact with Svetlana all the time, so uh, I'll do that. All right, I'll show it then. Very nice. Hold on, hold on. I got to get it here. Okay, so this is my channel. Okay. And so I'm sure it says subscribe right there. Something subscriptions must be no. Uh huh. Wait, wait. That was wrong. That was okay. where I didn't. I mean, on a regular one, it must say subscribe someplace or other. Maybe if I actually play something, let's see. No, I'm not seeing it. I see it all the time, usually. Yeah. <laughs> when you want something, it's... Uh, yeah, know. then it's not there. There is a bell. This is... This is... I'm, I, I, I saw bell. This is subscribe. This is what I intend to do. I can't remember because I haven't subscribed to things. In, oh, here, right here. See this? See down below, subscribe. See yes. that in red. Yeah. Yes. That, that that subscribes you to that person's uh, channel. Okay. For example, I want to be to see uh, Marsha or yours channel. I must to to enter to subscribe here. Yes. That's yeah. my real name, but it I should know. be Marsha Love. Marsha Lovely. <laughs> Marsha Lovely. Oh, I see. Because you have Facebook under one and and yeah, YouTube Facebook under the other. So my... every time I can't remember which one is it. All right. I don't so... know who I am either. <laughs> I must to be masked because here I have. Friends. All right, here she is. Here she is. Here she is. And see right there. See, subscribe. Yeah, I want you to go to the Houston uh, uh, Vinkel. I'm putting on all their. Uh, 
uh, programs. You're changing the subject, Marcia. She hasn't figured this out yet, and you're changing to another subject. No, she's fast. Don't worry. She, but Lana, do you see? Here's Marshall Lovely's yeah, channel. Yeah, I and, see, I see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah, and you can subscribe if you want over here. Marcia, we have a bunch of not native English speakers here. Slow down. But I, I know what they're saying, and I know what they need, and so I... Right, but don't talk so fast and change subjects so fast. Well, I think they're, you're fast. I think they're, you're faster than I they're, am. They're, they're, all in a, they're all in a second language. They're not in their native language. Okay, so. that's why I present you. You go ahead. All right, all right. Sve Svetlana, what do you need next, or what, what would you like to hear about next? For example, I want to see Marcia's Canals. I need to do subscribe here. Yes. yes. You don't. No, you don't have to be a subscriber in order to see her channel. No, I'm not, no. On YouTube, I understand what I do. Yeah. She wants to be. But if I want to be, uh, for example, Marsha has uh, I don't know, fifty person who all times uh, saw her channel, and I want to be. Fifty first. What I need to do? Subscribe. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Then they'll they'll send you a notice every time I put something on there. Oh, okay. But the thing is, Svetlana, I know you've got some wonderful, talented people, and I want you to come on my channel, uh, on my webinar, and they if they need to get paid, we'll we'll have somebody collect the money. Ever. Everbright, Evan, I'm not sure the name, but they can can collect the money for them. So uh, try to think about some of the wonderful, talented people that you are uh, associated with, and uh, they have a place to come and present their programs. It could be half an hour, an hour, whatever time they need, and nobody will interrupt them because it's uh, called a webinar. And the uh, presenters, are, uh, they can keep talking and nobody will bother them with papers or any, you know, what we have with the usual Zoom. This is something special. Uh, okay, so I'm doing what is with... Uh, the difference between webinar and Zoom program? Yes, it's a big difference. Uh, the webinar is... Uh, the presenter, either uh, one person, two people, what whoever is on the panel, they they are in control, and the other people come and they really don't see anybody else. But you can have five hundred people at a webinar. Uh, usually, we have programs that it's like uh, from thirty people or fifty people. Some pro, uh, Zoom programs I've seen they go up to seventy five or whatever. But the but the webinar you can go up to the thousands. I paying I'm paying for it and I'm allowed five hundred. So uh, it, it's, it's just, more it's more like being in a stage production a yes, webinar. Yes, that's it's like you have some people who are doing the presentation. Everybody else is invisible to each other and just sits there and watches. And yeah. they can make comments in the chat if they want to applaud or. Yeah. Or say how, how wonderful that was. They can say it in the chat, but they can't. Like we right now, we're all seeing each other. We're talking yeah. with each other. It's just the one person or a few people, and everybody else is just watching in a webinar. There, there is something else, Omari. There's a question and answer, or what they yeah, call Q and A. Right. So the so the people in the audience can ask. Uh, you know, if they want to request something, and they want, and and the uh, right. presenter wants to answer them, that's a possibility. So what I'm looking for is talented people that want to uh, do a presentation, or even pe very intelligent people that want to discuss a book, say a Yiddish book, or something that would really be very interesting to us, uh, educational. So they can come on and do their presentation, and uh, you know, it, it, other people will will learn from it. So it's a good place. It's a good place to come, and so I want to share only, it. I'm sorry. This is only about how many people you have. 
or another difference? For example, webinar, is there more people than Zoom? Yes, 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 you could have more people. But you have to pay more, you have to pay for it. I Zoom, pay for it, yeah. I pay right, a regular much. Zoom is free to, to have, create a Zoom room. Well, well it's... it's uh, Zoom not free too, but... No, it's not exactly free. We pay uh, the beginning of the year. The host pays for the program and then gives it free to everybody else. But I am paying for this additional thing and I'm giving it free to everyone also. I have this uh, 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 capability of doing webinars and I'm, I want to share it with people that have uh, educational and entertaining things for us. So just keep that in mind. Okay, so I wanted to show everybody something about YouTube. Usually when you go to someone's channel like this, you're on their home page and you only see what they happen to decide to share. Uh, they it's an arcane thing in there where where you say I you know I want to put this on my home page. And so you only see a few of the things that they remembered to share. But if you go to videos, you see everything that they shared. And I, uh, that... one other thing I want to throw in there. Wait, I hold have... on, hold I... on, hold on, hold on. One... Don't forget me. I won't. If you go to playlists, then you see the playlist. That's probably what you wanted to say, right, Marshall? That's probably, yes. That's yeah. True. Then you see that they designed a group of things to put together under a theme. Like uh, the trio in time, this is all the probably all the different trio in time concerts that Marcia has recorded. Uh, this is all her stuff from the Houston Winkle where she's recording the uh, our meet our Yiddish meetings. So if don't just stay when you go to a, a someone's channel, don't just stay on their homepage. Click on videos and you'll see way more stuff that they have. Uh, upload it. Everybody got that? Okay. It's uh, uh, it's another okay, thing beginners now. don't know. Marcia? Marcia, you close. Uh, okay. Um, uh, um, do a video from a recording video. Can do only host or another person too? Uh, the host can give them permission, other people permission to record, probably mm -hmm. by making them a co-host. Although it is possible to set up a Zoom room where you give everybody permission to record. You have to do it when you set up the Zoom room. Mm -hmm. Okay? But if they didn't do that, if they didn't know how to do it or they forgot to do it, and you're in a meeting and you want to record, you can say to the host, please give me permission to record, and usually it's by making you a co-host. And where is this? Where, where is this? This is in my program when I do uh, Zoom. Um, no, I must do this uh, possibility in Zoom when I do all another criterion or this technique, uh, technique. for example, I want another, not me, another person want to record our program. Okay. Yeah. And so you, uh, you as the host, uh, you know how to make them a co-host? You know how to do that? Yes, she does. Maybe not. The uh, way you do it is you go into participants. You know mm -hmm. where participants, participants is? Participants, I know where. Well, yeah, and you uh, on the on that person's name in participants, there'll be a thing that says more. Ah, uh -huh. I do if you know. hover over it, it says more, and there you can say make co-host. Ah, uh -huh. okay, okay. Uh, I did this. Okay, I, I one of. Yeah. Thank you so much. This way. Yeah. Sure. What else? I have another thing I just f found out the other day from someone. How to send large files over the internet. It took me all night to do it. I had to leave my computer on uh, overnight. And I sent, instead of uh, putting it onto YouTube, because it was I'm getting too many things on my YouTube, and I did this hour and a half recording, 
and I sent it to the person. To, uh, it's, it's called uh, We Transfer, W E Transfer. You, you can sign up, it's free for, for a limited amount because this was an hour and a half and I, uh, I was able to send it free to another person. But like I said, it took me all night to do it. I left my computer on the whole night and then in the morning he received that uh, recording. Cause and recording uh, us automatically. Uh, for example, if I want to do recording, I need to ask people in them want yeah. to be recording. But Absolutely. I see that recording do this automatically. Yes, got it, got it or no? Yes. If they don't want to be recorded, they they can leave the meeting or they could uh, mm -hmm. put themselves the video not to show themselves because we have people that don't like to be seen on the on the video. So when they know that it's especially if they're in their bathroom. If they're in the, yeah. A lot of times I'm in my scruffy bathroom because I'm comfortable and I don't want anyone yeah. to see me. <laughs> right, right. So then you put, you put yeah. the video. Then I hide on. myself. So, Marsha, the other way you can do that, do you know about Dropbox? Yeah, Dropbox. Uh, right. I, I have Dropbox with Zoom, but show, talk to her about Dropbox. Okay. I have again I haven't done this for a while because I haven't needed to. So let me share my screen. Here's Dropbox. It's just dropbox.com. And uh, you can put I uh, here's an account. I have this is all the things I have on in Dropbox that I, I needed for something or other, but you just can, uh, I think you just drag stuff over here. And uh, then I think it gives you a link to where it is and you can share that with anyone. It's just a little external, external uh, storage space where you can put things at, and then you can tell people to go there and, and download from there. I sent all the poetry really uh, to to, uh, to Fred. I had a lot of poems that he wanted, and I packed them up in Dropbox and mm -hmm. on Zoom, and, and he was able to get it. So it's another easy way to, to transfer a big file. Yeah. I think the reason that one you did took you all night is because it was a really big video. It was a right? really big. It was a musical. Yeah. No, normally, musical it, no, yeah. normally for an image or a small video, it just takes a few minutes. Yeah. So. Very nice. Thank it was my that. first time. I was happy that it worked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, the so magic of the. This the magic video. of computers. No, you see, the thing is, uh, if I did the recording, I have to do the editing and then put it on YouTube. I, so it was getting from, too much for me. So I, I'm giving him the file. He could take whatever songs he wants and make yeah. his, uh, you know, uh, yeah. whatever he wants to put on yeah. YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. So... There's okay, we, one way to do things. That's the wonderful thing about the uh, computer. We learn something new every day, how to do this and how to do that. And like Marie will tell you that. Without end. Without end. <laughs> you, you ask Google, or you Google it or you put it on, uh, go on YouTube. How do I do this? How do I do that? All the answers are there. Somebody wants to so, help. So since nobody has some any questions, I'm going to show you some neat things, okay? Everybody want to learn some neat new things? All right, let's let me share my screen. So this is for Marsha, but other people probably would like to learn how to do this. Marsha, you always have a problem with you can't remember email names of uh you know when people give you uh uh they give you like uh zabi. 1513 at aol.com and then you're like who was that right well right? no 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 i know when i go on it the name comes up the name comes up when i go on my it goes it comes up as zobby right 
Come All right. What's their name? Vera. It'll say Vera. All right. You're lucky. You, your, your computer managed to recognize it. But let's say someone gives you Zobby1513 at AOL.com. Okay. So here I just, I made, I'm about to send, you know, I made a, an email I want to send to someone. And up at the top, let's say it just says Zobby. Okay. So what you can do in the, in the email that you're about to send, you do edit address. Nobody knows how to do this. I know this because I used to be on Unix at the very early days of computers. So I learned. So all you have to do, let's say you see it like this. Okay. See it like that. And you're like, I'll never remember who that is. I'll never remember. This is Vera. So all you do, you do edit address. Oh, come on. Come up. Edit address. It changes to this. That's editable. You go here at the beginning and you type Vera's name. And then this is very important, but you have to remember it. You do this sign, the whatever it's called, the, the sideways V at the beginning and the back. That means it's just saved this at the, as the address, but it's made it, it's given it a name, and now you'll see Vera's name. Follow what I'm telling you? Can you put yeah. it in your contact list too? Yeah. 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 yeah, I don't bother with that. But if somebody sends me, you know, some... Uh, uh, do you ever have this problem when a lot of times... Things get uh, uh, in there, and they're a mistake. And then you go to send the email to that person, and the mistake comes up instead of right. How you, do you, you get have, rid of your mistake? You have to change that in your what did you just call it? The uh, contact, contact list. list. You have to go into contact list and find it. Um, I don't use that, so but I know I I have done it before. Let's see where. Do you remember where contact list is? Because I hardly ever use it. I have it on the left side. I have AOL, so mine is on the left. You know, like. Oh, you're doing it online. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so you have to um. You have to go on AOL then, and and change your contact list. And I don't remember. I haven't used AOL yeah, yeah, in. I have G Gmail also. I think it might be similar. Gmail and hot and yeah, you'll have to you'll have to find your contact list on there and uh, uh, and change it into contact list if you want to do it permanently. You can yeah. change it on an individual email, but then I don't think it saves it for permanent. Okay. Yeah, because <laughs> it, it could be a problem. Could keep coming up, and you keep accidentally right. Okay, using. here's another thing that a lot of people don't know. They go in and they write. They write a whole letter, you know, they write all the, oh, dear, dear friend, I want to tell you, blah, 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 blah. And then they hit send, and it doesn't work. And they've lost this. I've heard this so moan so many times. I, I wrote you all this wonderful thing, and then I didn't, I lost it, you know. <laughs> Is so, it the draft? Well, I'm typing, yeah, I'm typing in an email. Actually, usually when I type something important, I do it on a text file on my computer first, and then I copy it into the email. If I, if it's something, you know, like uh, precious where I want the words just right, you know, yeah. uh, sorry, I have to break up with you. I really love you, but, you know, <laughs> anyway, once you type something either in, in a text file or in an email, before you hit send, do copy. Copy it. Go up here and choose copy. Okay? Right before you send. Choose copy. Also, when you're on Facebook or any other place and you write a nice message that you want, you you know, something you want to, you don't want to have to redo, right before you post, do copy. And then you send it. And if it's sent successively and it went into your send folder, you can forget it. But if anything happened, you just go in a text file and paste it, and now you, you haven't lost it. 
Yeah. I have another, I don't know. Maybe I, I've heard this moan so many times, you know, and I'm like, you should have copied it before you sent it, you know? But you know what AOL does? It sometimes you think uh, all of a sudden you accidentally shut down and you were in the middle of a, a writing a, a, a letter, it will go into your draft. Right. You might look in they, draft, they, ha might be there. they have that now, yeah. They yeah. have that. Where now. does it go when you copy? Where where does it go? Where does it's, your copy? It's, called, it's called your copy memory. It means the computer memory. has memorized it, but you have to open up a text file and then paste it into there to see it. How do you do that? Do you you probably have Word on your computer? Yeah. Yeah, you open up a Word file. I don't use Word, but on PCs, that's what most people use. I use Libra. It's uh, up to date and it's free. Uh, and um, it's the same thing as Microsoft, but it doesn't cost anything. Anyway, Libra? Libra. L I B R E. You could go on the internet and and put it on your computer. L I Libra. Libra. Like a Libra? Yeah. L I B R E is the name of it. R R E. And they, they, they say if you want to give a donation, but it's not necessary. Just use it for free. And the other thing to, that is a tip that a lot of people don't know is when you're in a Word document or any other text editor and you're writing up, you know, you're, you're writing your modern American novel or your poem that you want to, you don't want to lose how you did it. I just save all the time. Every few lines I hit save again. That way, if anything goes wrong, I got it as far as I got. I haven't lost it. A lot of people wait to save. They write a whole chapter, and then they do save. And then if the if something happens bad, they've lost it. I got in this habit when I was using Photoshop, because every stage of Photoshop, I would do a save, so I would have as far as I got. But now I do it in a text file as well, like in Word, when I'm writing you know, a chapter of a book or something, every few paragraphs I hit save again. Whenever I think of it, I do save again. That way, if anything happens, which some once in a while it won't save properly or your computer goes down or God knows what, you know, you got it as far as you got. You haven't lost it. Okay, I'm off my podium now. What else? <laughs> Well, maybe we gave them enough for one day. Yeah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> I, well, you know, just Vera, Vera, will, Vera will have to go back and watch the recording to remember everything that got said, right? <laughs> yeah, if you have the patience and you want to watch this recording, it'll be in the playlist. <laughs>